what made you decide that uh, India is not the destination which you will prefer to go further or practice further? I always wanted to study abroad and experience life abroad, so which is why I decided to go to Australia. But I am going to do a Juris Doctor there. I think this JD course you could have went directly after 12th also. Okay. JD is a postgraduate course. Okay. You have to have an undergrad course before that, but specifically law karna zaruri nahi hai in your UG. Since you were studying in NLU, can you explain a little about NLU, how is the life there? Is it easy to get admission or is it difficult? How is the teaching really in NLU? What made you decide that uh, India is not uh, the destination which you will prefer to go further or practice further uh, about your law courses, but rather you selected Australia? So what made you decide that I should leave the country and study somewhere else? Yeah, so my reason was very personal. I always wanted to experience life abroad. I always wanted to move to another country and experience different cultures and experience what living there means. Everybody says, says you know, that the standard of life is better in, say, Australia, America, in the UK. And I wanted to experience that for myself. So even now, right now, I'm, going, I'm moving to Australia next month and I am going to do my course there. And in the time that I do my course, I will see for myself whether that standard of living is something that I want. But like I wanted that option for myself right. three years later to be able to decide if I want to come back or stay there. So, right. yeah. So since I've lived a lot of years in abroad, I can <laughs> tell you that living there is not easy. Yeah. And secondly, the standard of life is good. There's yeah. no second doubt about it. But yeah. then again, it's all about the freedom which we get in India hmm. that is very limited there. Yeah. And also, yeah. I was in Australia last month. I spent like <laughs> yeah. two weeks there. Yeah. And uh, you will sometimes get lonely there because you don't really have many friends. But since you are going in Aust uh, university, hmm. so you will be able to make a lot of friends. Yeah. So that is one thing which I wanted to tell you. But yeah. my real question is like, do you think that every student if given a chance, should experience study abroad or these opportunities where he can challenge himself as culturally or challenge himself as like, you know, when we live in Jaipur or small yeah, cities, yeah, yeah. we kind of have that different mindset. We are the best and we have this and that. But I think for me also, if you have studied abroad, you kind of get challenged on a lot of aspects of your life. Yes. So that you will face. And uh, so as you were saying, you were in, I'm sure you were in 20 top percent of <laughs> your class. So you had a lot of good opportunities here in terms of saving, uh, getting your chances into a good form. Yeah. But this is the time when you want to challenge yourself. Yeah. So what do you want to say to other people who are in your stage yeah. or who are actually preparing in 12th or trying to get into NLUs and trying to get into law as a field? What are your recommendations so far to the, those guys? Law as a field is a great field to be in, first of all. And I'd say that uh, if you're in 11th or 12th and you're planning to do law, then for sure attempt CLAT, give it your 100%, study very properly because it is possible. I also did it and like thousands of other students like me did it. So you can, if you focus your studies, if you, you know, use your faculty in your uh, institute well, mm -hmm. then you can get into an NLU. It is not a very hard thing. You can get it. And secondly, life abroad, something I haven't been yet, but I have friends who are studying abroad at the moment and I was facing all of these questions three, four months ago that should I move abroad and it will be challenging along with the freedom and uh, all the life that you experience over there comes responsibility. Yes which is tremendous responsibility towards your own self, towards your career and what I'll do two years later, whether I'll be employed, all of that is there. But a few friends of mine, since they're already there, I phoned them and I asked them and all of them had very good reviews to give. And they were like, that this is a chance in life. I'm 24 and this is a chance in life to really go for it and challenge yourself and decide for yourself if you like it, to each their own. So I really believe that if you have the opportunity and if you want to experience a different life altogether, if you want to give yourself that kind of freedom and also embrace responsibility, then one should definitely go for it because it's an experience like no other as I've heard. Right. And I'm sure I'll feel the same way one year later. Right. 